Xbox.com. I can't be on the petty blog. <laughs> so Floyd Mayweather and Logan had their press conference for their June 6 matchup, or should I say mismatch? Reason I say mismatch is because Logan is 6'2 and about 200 pounds, and meanwhile Floyd is only 5'8 and 150. Now, I'm not the lightest bright when it comes to boxing, but I'm pretty sure that that's a whole different weight class, no? Correct me if I'm wrong. And plus, Floyd is damn near 20 years older than his kid. And not to mention, Floyd is a professional boxer who's been doing this probably longer than Logan has been alive. So why give a super rookie who's a damn YouTuber such a chance? Like, why would one come out of retirement and on top of that, take one hell of a pay cut than what he usually gets? He will be getting one third less than his last fight in 2017. So you really coming out of retirement for that? Wow. Oh, but wait, here's Floyd's answer to that. Hi, Logan Paul. Um... Logan Paul is huge on YouTube. It's a huge following. Wait, what? Oh, so you only giving him a chance because he gets a lot of views? No comment. Anyway, no one in the boxing world or outside of it thinks that this is a good idea, this matchup. And although Floyd is very capable of knocking this dude out, cold at that, it can go another way. And here's why. Logan and his brother are only chasing clout off of Floyd and Floyd took the bait without thought. Look, they just want to go down in history for knocking the greatest out. So it would so not surprise me if Logan pulls hella fouls, hitting below the belt and all types of stuff to make it more of a street fight in the ring just to accomplish that, knocking him out. It also wouldn't surprise me if his brother the Jake, who's equally as big as far as weight and height, illegally jumps in the ring and double team him, jumping him. It might sound crazy, but it's so possible and it's not far-fetched considering them. I really believe that win, lose, or draw, their goal is to have Floyd laid out flat on the ground like Nate Robinson. That's cold. Hey Floyd Mayweather, June 6th, I'm gonna kick your ass. <laughs> I mean, Floyd did say that he could take both of them, but he was clearly joking because, you know, he thought they were playing. But these dudes are playing, but they're not. Get my drift? They do play too much, but they're seriously trying to take Floyd out. They are clearly the types that don't mind doing whatever to stop Floyd's legacy. So while Floyd is thinking that this fight is just entertainment to get paid per view, these dudes see it as a joke to trick him out of his spot. He came out for retirement just to get re-retired. It sucks that a YouTuber is going to take all and that guess what? Mm. Speaking of Jake, not only did he disrespectfully call a billionaire's brand new Air Force Ones that nobody stepped on dirty, he intentionally planned to steal his hat and he did that. I'm about to steal Floyd Mayweather's hat. Hmm? What's up? You wanna you wanna run it two in one night? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's up? What's up? Yeah, I wanna run it two. Absolutely. You wanna run it two in one night? Absolutely. Absolutely. Let's make it happen. Let's do it. Let's make it happen. Let's make it happen. Yes, sir. Get the paperwork for this ball. Get El Hamid. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me call El Hamid. Let's make it happen. Two in one night. Got your hat. I'm my own boy. I'm my own boy. One night, got your hat. He got a lisp. Commotion. Jake Paul started it. No, not Jake Paul. Yeah. The younger brother, whatever his name is. Get out, get out. Oh, 
Yeah, this ain't no game. They have no idea. These kids, they do a lot of popping. All right, y'all. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go, baby. Got your hat. Don't play with me with your hat. Play with me with your hat. Whew. It went good. Got your fucking hat. <laughs> Kid wanted to test the waters and try me out. He stole your hat. No cap. <laughs> right, that was a good one. Not no cap. I can't. But wait, now we know that 50 just had to troll his old best friend, right? He put this picture up and captioned it. What the F going on on champ head? Crying laughing. I heard he had his pubic hairs put on his face. LOL. <laughs> he crazy. But wait a minute, hold up. Why Floyd look exactly like 5th in this picture though? Wow, if y'all been brothers this whole time, just say that. Nah, but yeah, it's all a mess and we pray that Floyd keeps his crown and gets that 51 to 0 because any other way will be tragic. Two fake fighters. The only thing that's fake on this stage is Floyd's fucking hairline. That was weak. Weak. Got your hat. Hey, after like thinking about it, I just want to say I like, I apologize for my behavior and I'm sorry. I shouldn't have acted that way and uh, you can suck my nuts. I'm just kidding. <laughs> But what are y'all thinking? We want to know, so leave your thoughts below. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to this channel for more. And don't forget to hit that bell to join the notification gang. PetsyBlog.com signing out.